that's a triple play. New episodes of Kill Way. the first gate, press play, no need to debate, AOA, check me out, look, clocked in, you can catch the hype, golden dawn, how we follow the light, anime like life, uh, married to it, my wife, uh. Hello and welcome back to the AOA show. I am your host as always, Ian, along with my boys, Isaiah. Yo, yo, yo. And Gavin. What's up? And due to popular demand, and just because we kind of felt like it, we're not going to give you guys all the credit, okay? We have to have some self-agency here. <laughs> um, this no. was our idea. Yeah, totally our <laughs> idea, not the comments at all. No, seriously, thank you guys for, for reaching out. What am I talking about? I'm talking about Tower of God and our promise that we made to you folks that came along for the journey of the anime with us. Um, that we are now officially reading the webtoon. So also we're in, in live action form here. So that's pretty freaking awesome. Uh, if you follow us, you'll know that we already dropped an episode on Monday um, on the movie, A Whisker Away. So if you haven't seen that, definitely go check that out. But that is the first time we've come back. We were on camera. It's been wild with the whole pandemic hitting and everything like that. We had to kind of bunker down and self quarantine. And that's why we had kind of the static image and you know, the, the just audio only format. And I know some of you guys were itching to see our faces in a live action form. This is what we used to do. Now we're back. We got some upgrades, which is pretty freaking awesome. And there's some cool stuff in store. Um, but I'm excited to, you know, kind of relive this, this, uh, this, this kind of thing is just leagues above my sure. opinion. Sure. Uh, and I hope you guys think the same. So anyway, we're here, but we'll be talking about the web tune. And again, thank you for everyone who commented and, and followed us and said, Hey, webtoon really did this really cool yeah, and yeah. you guys should definitely read the webtoon i'd love to know your thoughts mm -hmm. so y'all better be here and y'all still better be commenting and let us know what your thoughts are now that we'll be up to speed with you guys um you know given some time so anyway we're going to talk about the format right now and by the way um this isn't necessarily set in stone yeah. i mean it's a pretty subject to change yeah. like depending on you know reception and <laughs> and <laughs> of course yeah, yeah. we want to see yeah we want to see how it goes over with yeah, you guys yeah. and how if you know how it is on us so if you get if you guys have any suggestions uh as to how you would prefer to watch it, if there's one way that's more comfortable or easy, easier, more digestible or whatever. I can't promise that we're going to, you know, like just switch it on a whim every yeah. week. Depending It'll be a on compromise what says, between but what yeah. you guys want to hear or how and, and how we feel the best way to like put it out. Exactly. But with that being said, right now we will be covering 10 chapters a week um, that we will be putting out. And then we will be talking about it, and at least for the first season, yeah. that is, we'll be relating it to the anime that we've watched, which is interesting because we're coming as anime watchers first. Right. Yeah. Um, you know, we hope that offers a slightly different perspective from, you know, the manga readers first and foremost. Mm -hmm. uh, but we'll be kind of comparing, contrasting some of those things as well as talking about the manga as a whole. And then if we do decide to continue past the first season with the manga, obviously we'll be just talking about its standalone thing. You know what I mean? From there. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, so hopping right into it, Let, let's get into yeah. it. So, um, I will say one thing. Okay. What initial impressions right off the bat? Okay. First of all, slightly jarring that the characters and stuff like that, obviously because like the drawing, Oh yeah, you yeah, know yeah. what I mean? That yeah. it's like, Oh, they're ugly. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. I was like, Oh Lord. I Definitely. mean, it's like a much more, uh, like raw. Yes. Mm -hmm. Uh, visual. This looks like the rough sketch. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah. Before they like, put I it have onto heard anime. though from people in the comments below. If you want, if you're like reading it on the webtoons app, like people comment below when you're done with the chapter, and a mm -hmm. lot of people say that they actually step up like the game. Really, that's of the, awesome. Of like the okay. animation that they and use I'm for sure drawing. Too. Yeah, like, I'm sure it's like weeks above chapter. as you go. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure yeah. once you, I mean that's like kind of even if you think about it. I mean I don't know. Like I read enough manga to know yeah, that like that even, that's just like it's art. like anime yeah, too. Yeah. It's like anything. Yeah, like, you start yeah. off it's rough and then you just but get like, more refined. Uh, even in comparison to the mm -hmm. anime, which like may or may not be a fair comparison, because I mean like like just depending on the production quality and stuff. But yeah. like you know what I mean. You watch the first episode of the anime and you're like, oh, this is a pretty unique style. And then you read yeah. the first chapter and you're like, whoa. Some <laughs> yeah. smooth lines. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Smooth yeah. Lines. And, and again, it'll be interesting, yeah. especially covering this first season, being that we are anime watchers first. You right. know what I mean? Yeah. Because it's like we've almost, in a sense, we've been spoiled aesthetically. You know, from sure. from that right. perspective, yeah. where it's because like, the, okay, it looks clean, it looks refined. The main, at least again, from what I've gathered from like commenters and stuff, is like the main uh, difference is that the anime actually leaves a lot out, mm -hmm. and like from our research into this, as far as like how we were going to cover it and, and how much goes into what. 
Like, I get it. I mean, sometimes they had to, they would scrunch like six or eight episodes in or chapters into an episode. Mm -hmm. So, like, mm -hmm. me, I mean, that happens with manga to anime, right? That makes sense. Um, but the main consensus is that the manhwa has just more info and like more character moments and all that stuff. So, it'll be interesting to, I guess, if anything, get more insight into yeah. like characters yeah, and, yeah. and moments. Yeah, and it'll be cool mm -hmm. to watch them grow in like a kind of different sense. And, you know, and, and it's like, while it does relate, obviously, to the anime, because this is what's derived from, it's like, I almost already because i i well I, I read ahead a little bit i'm like 30 chapters deep whatever but it's like it's almost like it's super close so far mm. like really close but it's like i do see some slight differences where i'm like okay like the manhwa in a sense and i have a feeling obviously as it goes on obviously since it once it passed the first season it's like it's almost like its own thing you know what mm. i mean like yeah. separate from the show in yeah. a sense that i've actually watched some creators do episode reviews on tower of god because they were so well received and the community was awesome that i was like i want to check out some other creators and i know there was one guy i can't remember his name it's like ace guru or something like that shout out he was he was he was good he did like you know breakdowns of every episode and stuff like that and i know he opted to not read the manhwa at all and he said listen guys like i enjoyed the anime i want to watch it as the anime i don't want you know what i mean like i want to be surprised i want yeah. these moments to hit all that kind of stuff so i'm kind of trying to almost look at this as a different story you know what yeah, i mean in, yeah. in a weird mm -hmm. way but that's like really closely yeah it's which like is which is good i think like again like when we're talking about manga to anime adaptations like that's what you should be going for it's an adaptation not like yeah. a literal cut exactly. and paste like you know what i mean manga doesn't or anime shouldn't because you can't they're two different like mediums of, of taking in of course the content so it's yeah. like if the manhwa mm -hmm. If the anime just replicates the manhwa, like it's gonna feel like that. It's gonna yeah. feel mm -hmm. dull. For like sure. The anime should be its own thing in a sense, and in a way, its own like telling of the story. Or yeah, for yeah. sure. But I mean, that was that was an initial thing, and I'm excited to see how these characters grow within art and within within the manhwa and all that kind of stuff. And it's cool because you know there are definitely more fleshed out moments. And so the first one I want to get into is so okay, we we've been here before, right? So yeah, yeah. Bam, Rachel, homies. Um, by the way, spoiler alerts for, you know what I mean? For anyone following that didn't watch the anime, um, yeah. you know you what I mean? watched, yeah, the anime or yeah. read the Or read the mom one. You're hopping on just initially. Just keep in mind there will be spoilers. Anyway, that's the disclaimer. So, okay, so we all know that Rachel's a cunt. So um, <laughs> <laughs> let's just get that under the rug. Let's just, there's like spoilers. <laughs> Rachel's a cunt. <laughs> let's just address the elephant in the room. You've been warned. So anyway, well, She's because it's interesting now looking in the light of this, right? So it's like, yeah. okay, we've been through this before. Bam and Rachel are friends. Oh, that's a good point. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. 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 It's like it's hard for me not to say yeah. it now. I have or to say like it. she says something and it's like, you. Dirt. Like, <laughs> you, you don't mean like, that. You know you why? Yeah, you know, you. she's like, I have to leave you, and you're like, Yeah, but you want to leave him, don't you? <laughs> so jerk. we've been through it before. She's running. I have to go to the tower. Bam tries to stop her. Really, not much difference there. Um, kind of the opening was the same. They get to the or Bam gets to the initial testing floor with heat on and the giant uh, Shinsu eel. Mm -hmm. So I want to say right off the bat, as compared to the anime, I do feel like that um, heat on. You definitely, like, at least the manhwa, from what it tells me, unless they're trying to throw me for a loop, but if I was a reader coming on, like, I thought it was way more abundantly clear that Hedon does not fuck with Bam. Yeah. Like, or oh, if, yeah. like, he does yeah. not like Bam. Like, he is really intentionally making this as much of a pain in the ass. And I could be wrong on that. It could be something where it's, like, he's, like, they're really leading you on, but it's, like, he really was on in Bam's corner. That's why he's making like it so hard. Type yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, something yeah. like that. But, I mean, from a first glance, like, He's being a dick and like even more so than like way more than the show. Cause in the show, oh, he yeah. seemed like a very neutral party to me. Right. Where it was it's like, like the, the anime, I feel like, uh, you know, again, just from my perception, like he character, like almost seems like a chaotic neutral, right? Like he's mm -hmm. very like, mm -hmm. I'm, I just want to see what happens, you know, like yeah. I'll give this nigga a sword, give this nigga a gun. <laughs> and like, I just, let's see which way the wind blows, you yeah. know? And it's like, he doesn't really like, like he, you know, works like for the tower and works for Jihad and, and, and all that stuff. But it's like, he really like does have this like sort of like twisted self interest aspect that plays at mm -hmm. least like perception wise. Yeah. Whereas in the manhwa, he really seems to be more of like no, I'm I need to like defend the natural order of the tower. Yes, and like he hasn't lost. There isn't like a loss of like that playfulness, I guess. Um, because like you know well, later when like Yuri comes in and she's like, yeah, what the fuck are you doing with this kid? You about to like send him into fucking war with like, a stick, <laughs> you know, or like nothing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, he still has that like oh I don't know what you're talking about. Like I'm just fucking playing around. Yeah. But it's like. Again, because I think, and this is just something I think like the written mediums always do have a better chance of doing. Um, there's there's just so many more like moments that you get with characters where sure. like every panel with heat on is like a moment of him being like, you know, 
well, I don't know what you're talking about. Like in the tower, like, you know, so-and-so should be able to do this. Like he's an irregular, he should be, you know, and it's like, and like, again, even like with him and like Yuri later on, like there's just so many more moments where you get these little character monologues or insights mm. where it's like, oh, okay. That's like what he's, yeah. that's what he's for thinking, sure. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah. I thought that was interesting though, because yeah. that, that definitely sheds light on his character mm-hmm. that much more that I'm like, oh, like now all of those like smirks with the teeth showing yep. and stuff like that mean like they hit harder yeah. and, or they hit different at least, you know, than they did in the, uh, in the anime. This scene also as, because we've watched the anime also hits different now knowing that Rachel's in the like she's in the room. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yep. The yes. whole time I'm reading this, I'm like, <clears throat> you're like, where's that? You're like oh, looking yeah. for that little cue. Like, where's yeah. this? Yeah, yeah. If there's like some sort of like gleam of white or some yeah, shit, yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah. And it's like, oh shit, like she was there, bro. Yeah. Um, but yeah, just that, and then like I know, like a little bit later, um, when Yuri shows it, like specifically, there's a very specific like moment that I remember from like Manwa to uh, anime, um, Yuri's entrance. Right, I remember in the anime, and I don't know why, like specifically, this like triggered something in me. But in the anime, it was like out of nowhere. Like, yeah, literally, literally one shot, yep. and then like the next frame was like Bam running, and then Yuri had like kicked him and like, flipped <laughs> off his head already. Yep. And I was like, oh, where did what the fuck? Yeah, and like the manhwa, there's like a literally literal five panels of yeah, the buildup, which yeah, is like just he's over like, it. is that a giant foot? And then like, you know what I mean? Yeah, and then, like yeah. she's coming down, and like you know that she's coming, so it's not like. Yuri drops mm. out of nowhere. It's like, oh, these two characters are yeah. about to meet. For sure. Um, yeah. Which is like, again, like there's so many more, I think if anything, like that's what I'm going to enjoy about mm-hmm. the manhwa is that there's so much more time you get with the characters by themselves yes. like, in their heads where it's like, I got to do this because of so-and-so or, or yeah. whatever, yeah. you know, yeah. um, as opposed to the anime, which, you know, not to its, you know, up or down, like however you want to look at it, like had to move, right? It had to like sure. get to the point of the story. Mm-hmm. So yep. a lot of it was very like, Bam is doing this. All right, now we got to go and do, you know what I mean? Yeah, and it's like yeah. In that moment, you lose like, well, wait, why did he think like, you know what I mean? So, yeah, but yeah, no, yeah. for sure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And uh, I want to kind of hop right into the scene that you were talking about right before um, Yuri mm-hmm. kicks Bam right in his fucking head <laughs> where her and Evan mm-hmm. are chilling at the yeah. like yep. up top, wherever yep. the fuck they were, you know what I yeah. mean? Uh, above them and kind of spectating. Cause again, this is cool in the mama because um, it, it keeps on referring to these elusive irregulars mm-hmm. and they keep on naming them and apologies. Then, you already know the name thing. It yeah. evades me. I can't remember all their fucking names. But anyway, the other regulars and like they are like touted as these like like legends almost. It's yeah. like they're fucking strong. So it's like mm-hmm. it makes so much more sense now as to why she comes down rather than just like, well, Bam's hot. You know what I mean? Yeah. Although that is still a reason. Don't yeah. get me wrong. But you know, um, and, oh but, yeah, that's another good. Yeah, point. like is she's the like they want to see with her and the Black March, mm-hmm. the, like the the being. Uh, inside the weapon yeah it's like i remember that was one of my initial complaints we watched the first two episodes i was like mm-hmm. we this can't just be a thing of bam getting off because he's lucky yeah like why and it's like literally that's like an afterthought yeah in the manga. Mm-hmm. it's like oh yeah and like he's he's kind of cute yeah but like th- mm-hmm. before that there's like six panels of her yep. explanation as to yeah. why she actually think, they, like, yeah you know, they want to like, keep their eye on him and she doesn't really know yeah. at first and it's like okay he's in a regular like is he gonna be what abilities right. he but i don't want to see i don't see. sense like like a, an immense amount of power like yeah I would move yeah from an irregular exactly thing. Yeah. and then they see that he's like kind of frail and weak, you know what I mean? And mm-hmm. I also wanted to talk about um, Evan's character, her guide as yeah, well, because yeah. I think they do, especially in these, this initial chapter here, they do a much better job at showing how intelligent he is and his deduction skills, mm-hmm. where you kind of get that vibe in the anime once he meets with the um, administrator, yep. um, and they kind of have that behind-the-scenes thing, like, okay, I know the politics here, Yuri, don't get involved with that bullshit. Like, And you're like, oh, okay, like this, mm-hmm. but like, from the get, like from you can jump. tell yeah. this guy from the jump, like from there, it's like, oh, okay, I see why he's the guy. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, well, he's, he's known. What's interesting is in the anime, you kind of look at him almost like a simp, you know, where he has that relationship <laughs> with Yuri, where it's like or literally Bam, the simp, or, <laughs> <laughs> like no, the ultimate. <laughs> <laughs> no, but like the relationship that they show in the anime is he doesn't really have a lot of dialogue. You know, like in uh-huh. the in the first chapter, he literally was like speaking a lot, and in the anime, it was more just like. Yuri saying, hey, bring me to this spot. And he's just like complaining. And you're like, all right, dude, like, what's your purpose? You know, yeah, like, you like, have no you real here? substance yeah. until he has that talk with the administrator in the anime. And you're like, okay, he has some relevance in education behind the world of what's going on. Where in, in the manhwa, you actually know he's not just an idiot. Like he knows his role and Yuri's role and everybody around him. And he's literally almost like her caretaker in a way. Like he's just trying to make sure she doesn't do stupid he's shit. He's trying to like steer yeah. her. Yeah. Steer yeah. her you know in the I mean? right direction. Yeah, yeah. Where yeah. it's almost like vice versa in the anime. It's like exactly. she's steering him and he's yeah. just along for the, the ride because yeah, yeah. he has no choice. The you anime know? Makes like, sense. paints the picture, I think, of him being sort of like a uh, like her assistant. Right. And I think the manhwa 
does a better job at painting him as like her advisor. Right? Yeah. Like mm-hmm. he's not, he's not like the, you know, I don't know. I'm trying to think of like whatever assistant to leader role, but he's more of like Shikamaru to Nar- Hokage Naruto. Yeah. Like he's the person that she more goes less, to yeah. like for advice. And he's the one that's like, wait, pump the brakes here. Like we got to mm-hmm. think about, it. you know what I mean? Yeah. And yeah. like, as such has he like intelligence that that role requires, you know, he's essentially, she's a princess ranker, right? So he has to be somebody capable of reigning in a princess ranker, yeah. you know? So that, so yeah, I think his character definitely gets like a lot more. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. Yeah. He gets a lot. He um, gets a lot more respect and credit deserved. I feel, you know what I mean? And again, we have yeah. heat on kind of like toying with them when they come down and it's like, again, this chaotic neutral, but you could tell he's like, okay, like he knows that he can't, he can't just like, Okay, I get the vibe that he wants Bam to fail. I could be wrong on that. Dead wrong. We're talking about 10 chapters here, yeah, right? Yeah. Right. But again, as as an initial impression. But he kn- but Hedon knows that like if Yuri comes down and Evan comes down, like he can't just straight up like he has to like kind of give in to like be like they're like, mm-hmm. why are you just putting him in disadvantage? He's like, Well, he can do this. And he's like, No, 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 you're being a dick. And it's like, okay, but Hedon is like smart and he's like, Okay, why don't you give him something? Yeah, that, you yeah. know what I mean. Why don't you do? That? Why don't like, you give him the most prized weapon that you? Yes, have? You know what I mean. Exactly. It's like and the, and the, uh, in the entire world. And the, yeah, <laughs> yeah. And the and the orb like the that translates. And also, the by the way, which is interesting, something I didn't realize is that is an A, a class A class one. Yep, yep. Whereas when you read later, spoiler alert, I don't know if they covered this in the first ten chapters, but they start with an E yes. class one. So it's like. Huge is upgrade, a, a huge, C-D-E, and they actually C-D-E, say E E D um, A B C D. So you have E D C. I think I think it's E D, E or D or something like that. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm, I'm going. I'm like assuming that it goes from down up. So you have uh, E and then you have a D. He's for and a surprise. Yeah, test. I was like, yeah. you're going through the alphabet. <laughs> no, 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 no. Like if it's what if you start at B? E, <laughs> no, if you start at E, you know it would obviously yeah, it have would to go, go up. Yeah, so yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. just thinking of how many levels like he yeah yeah yeah. But it's it's like assuming they. I would assume they have S two or something. It's implied that he's just in that feat alone. He's getting a tremendous head mm-hmm. start, so to speak, and yeah. climbing a tower. But also something that I don't believe was in the anime is he can't even understand what they're saying to him until he gets the yeah, pocket. Yeah, that's what was the really The pocket literally yep. translates. The pocket, thank you. Yuri is talking to him, and he's like, what are you saying to me? Yeah. And then he goes to grab the pocket, and she's like, do you understand me? And he's like, yeah. oh, shit, I can hear Which makes length. so much more sense Which now. makes so much more sense. And, like, yep. again, like, like gives that moment so much more. In the anime, right. it literally kind of just makes Bam look like he's just running with the punches. Yeah. You know, he's just like here and he's like, all right, uh, yeah, I'll take this and you want me to, oh, okay, cool. Yeah. You know, but yeah. here it's like, you know, it's like, oh, fuck, okay. Like, all yeah. you just get so much more yeah. information that you yeah. can like run. Like, I think it's funny if the first two episodes, because I think that's when we watched it initially, we just did the first two. Mm-hmm had this much information on it, I would have been sold with the show. Yeah, I remember yeah. I was very, like, hesitant and skeptical because I was like, I don't know, like, what this thing is about. I don't know yeah. what's going on. Um, but, like, this, all this information now, it's like, even after the fact, it's like, yeah. Yeah. oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah. Everything is fleshed out. And it's like, we could go tit for tat on every single thing. We don't want to be here for three hours. But, again, like, you know, even when he goes and takes the eel test, it's like Evan has this whole internal monologue where yep. it's like, again, showing how smart he is. I actually like him so much more in the yep. mom line yeah. and so much more as a character now because yep. uh, he's like, Okay, no, there is actually only one way he passes this, but there's no way he's going to see it. Yep. He has to stand there. He has to be eaten. He has to be blah, blah, blah. And it's like, you know, in the anime, it's just like, they. to be fair, in the anime, even though they don't fully flesh it out, they explain why. It's like, holy mm-hmm. shit, like he got that, you yeah. know, which is kind of the same way, or like both roads lead to the same destination. Exactly. One's just way shorter. Um, but yeah, like it, it was it was cool to see those fleshed well, out that, things. And they had it with him and Yuri, because obviously when Evan, or not Evan, fucking... um. Wow, how did I already forget his name? He Don Bam. No, Bam. Jesus fuck. Yeah. Right. That was like a weird mind <laughs> The main fart. character. I was, just like, I was like, what's his name? By the no. way, the 25th Bam. The 25th Bam. Which I don't they they do. They, they say that, that in the anime. In the anime? They okay. Not, okay. I, I don't know forgot. if it's initial, like in the, his first introduction. Yeah. But I know mm-hmm. if it's not there, I remember when, uh, you know, he's with Kuhn and everybody. And yeah. they, they pass the second test. Okay. And they all meet. He's yeah. like, okay. oh, I'm 25th Bam. Oh, but it's weird because he makes it a point, at least in the manhwa, to where like every interaction he puts in, like, I'm the 25th. Yeah, yeah, like he it wasn't just one little bit more like every cordial. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and I don't even think he knows what that means, but I feel like that is relevant. I could be oh, wrong, I mean, but I, like I would way. feel like the twenty fifth yeah. bam. Yeah. It's like what is this like the Avatar? You know what I mean? Like yeah, what the yeah, fuck? Yeah. Well, going I looked up here, supposedly yeah. the translation in Korea for bam night, is right? night and chestnut. It has two yeah. meanings. I would assume they're going with okay. night, well, I'm, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a little nut over there. I could turn there chestnut. I'm twenty fifth of the month. Maybe Rachel has killed twenty four bam before him. She's like, well, I don't know. Get it right this time. But it is. Cool, like thinking of him as the twenty fifth night. You know yeah, what I mean? Like yeah, there's yeah. something eerie that comes along with that name. But anyway, yeah. 
you were you were saying I cut oh, you off. Oh, I'm so sorry. so what I really liked about it is um when he was taking the test with the eel, and you know initially when he was getting swallowed, they really went in depth with Yuri, like more or less having like a mental breakdown where yeah. she's like, I need to go help him, and Evan's like, you know, holding her back, like, no, you can't, you know, if you interfere with the test, that breaks the rules, blah 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 blah, and they keep on running with that, and in my mind, I was like. Why are you freaking out? Like this is literally what Evan just told you he needs to do. Like although he didn't, he just I don't think he every, said it though. He did. Think, he did. At oh, that he point. did. Yeah, because I, I was literally, I was reading it. it. I was reading it, and I was like, Yuri, calm down. Like this is what like he had yeah, like yeah. mentioned before. But obviously in the moment, she's just watching this kid just walk up and like just yeah, standing there. Yeah. He's not moving or anything. But I like that interaction because then afterwards he actually said to Yuri like. Hey, you need to stop freaking out. Calm down. Right. This is the answer that I just told you. And yeah. she was like, oh, yeah, shit. But, you know, she didn't have that, like, initial faith in him. Because sure, why yeah. would you really? Or I think at it, him, it know, emphasizes first. that, like, again, like, when when the anime, it feels like, to be honest, up until Bam gets to, um, I want to say, like, the third test, mm-hmm. right? That was the one after, like, the whole water wall thing. The what the crown yeah um, not the crown game the one where they have to pick a door are you talking about yes that's the third test yeah. uh, up until that point it felt like mm-hmm. everybody was just fucking with Bam dude like it felt <laughs> like literally not a single person yeah. genuinely had his best interest at heart and everybody was like how can I use this nigga you know yeah, and like yeah. that was it where this scene even alone in the manhwa Yuri even before like he goes to take the test very clearly is putting stakes in him because. Because of the fact he's an irregular. She's like, he has, people don't like irregulars because yep. they are fated to be able to like, have the power to change things. Yeah. They can yeah. rewrite history yeah, within feared. the tower. Mm-hmm. And like, clearly, she has a stake in that. She yes. wants that to happen. And that's why she's going out on such a limb to help him. So like, the moments like that pay off where it's like, she has stake if he loses now and gets eaten. You know what I mean? Like, that was her, this is her ticket. This is her ticket to change things. For sure. So it's like, again, just all the more, you know, all yeah. the more character. Yeah. Yep. So then we hop into the, um, Technically, the first test for everyone else. Yeah. But bam, second, right? Yeah, because yeah. nobody else is getting that eel and test. That fucker yeah. didn't even miss a beat, dude. Yeah, like, yeah. Literally, he was just like, I went through all that bullshit. And it's like, yep, now have fun. Like, 400 of you, 200 of you are going to yeah, pass. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, good luck. And he's just like, bro, I fucking just, uh, I, a eel <laughs> ate me, dude. I got fucking eaten yeah. by Can I get eel. five minutes? Can I get a second? <laughs> dude, I was actually cackling when I read that. And I was like, bro, they're not giving him a fucking break. That like, was fucking uh, great. It, it was really good. Now, the first test from what I could surmise is, is pretty fucking spot on with the anime. Yeah, I don't know. Really you guys was. can correct me if I'm wrong. Is if there's anything I'm missing? Um, like that they go like over anything. in the in the uh, manhwa that they don't in the anime. Another thing I wanted to go over too, actually, was um was Rack in the uh, in the webtoon here and how much that the manhwa credits him to how terrifying he is as yeah. a character just in general. So I'm kind of scrolling over some of these shots and again aesthetically, like he looks similar, mm-hmm. right? But it's like the manhwa does these really good jobs and make him, especially at first, coming from initial impressions, like actually terrifying right it's like when you when you look yeah, at him like a literal beast which like, is really yep. cool you know what i mean to see and um again we don't really get to see rack cut loose even in the anime mm-hmm. even in here really i would say as of yet i man i am looking forward to that fucking day like i really want him to cut loose because it's like i hate for him to just have the because okay you look at him initially and he's like terrifying right in the manhwa in the anime, he's like, okay, he's pretty, he's pretty scary, and then like, there's, it's pretty, it's pretty soon after that you like the comedic value starts to come in with him, which is great, by the way. I do love how funny he is as a character, just in general. Um, but you know, when Coon and Bam are kind of just like unafraid, especially Coon, in in like his own way, and it's like almost like he's there for comedic value, and it's like he fights, and it's clearly indicated that he's strong. He's one of the stronger fighters out of the mm-hmm. lot. Um, but like, you never really get to see just how strong. You know what right, I mean? Yeah, it's like, yeah. that's something that I really want to see. Right. You know what I mean? It's like these small little gauges that you have, like in the anime when he like misses with the spear, the one guy hits it. Okay. Mm. Okay. That's reminiscent to say he's not technically at that guy's level. There's things like that, but I'm just really curious to see that again, beyond that, the, the, the initial test for everyone else is pretty damn similar. Coon's yeah. going around doing his thing, trying to collect teammates. Cause he's smarter than that. <laughs> um, you know, kind of takes an interest in bam, just purely out of curiosity. Cause it's like, why do you have the black March? Why do you not even know what the black March is? Why do you not know why the fuck you're here? You know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, like yeah. this alligator wants to kill you. You know what yeah. I mean? Like you're far <laughs> too interesting for me to, to just let you be. Yep. So, you know, that's how it goes. We get, um, uh, what's her name? Anak and, uh, hot are yeah. fighting each other. And, um, mm-hmm. you know, they, they are doing their thing and then they do the, um, low, uh, what is his name again? Low row, low row, low row, low row, 
The ranker. The ranker? Yeah. Oh, Lero Row. Lero Row. Okay, yeah. sorry, it's a tongue t- twister. I was, I was like, who are you talking Lero about? Lero Row say, basically is like, okay, pair up in squads of three, the whole nine. Um, I don't really think there's anything I'm missing from there, but there's really not much, too much to go over mm-hmm. for all of you that have, you know, seen it. You've probably already seen it. I don't want to spend too much time on that, but they do the initial testing. And then from there, I'm pretty sure the last two chapters include, if I'm not mistaken, they do the... Uh, did you guys get, again, I read That's ahead, so I can't wall. remember. Did, yeah. did, they, did yeah, they cover that? The, yeah, okay, yeah they cover it. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So let's talk about that, um, which is, again, pretty similar. There's not really many differences that I that I see in there, but we kind of mm-hmm. go back to the conversation um, that Lara Rowe and Bam have about, like, irregulars yeah. and, you know what I mean? Like, who's doing what and where and why. Mm-hmm. Um who do we have? Oh, it's cool too. We actually, I don't know if this was in the anime much. Maybe I just missed it, but there's the small girl, the blonde that has the, um, the bird of Shinsu oh, yeah, in the yeah. jar and, uh, the knight that's on her team. Mm-hmm. And I don't know if they went over their like small relationship in the anime at this point, because it's been oh, a while. I know what you're saying. But now at mm-hmm. least maybe I missed I it, but I thought it was interesting. I, it, I, I think it's because we have the context of the anime because we know be how it. much of a role that little girl ends up playing in the mm-hmm. later test. Yeah, yeah. Because I sure as shit did notice her in the anime, but like looking <laughs> no. back on the manga <laughs> Not or the manhwa, yeah. now I'm like, oh shit, it's her from, like, you know what I mean? It's her from that moment in the anime. So it's like, I, I uh, that's, I guess, another cool, I was talking about it a little bit earlier, but it's like the payoff of having seen this story, you know, to an extent already, it's like, you know, it's kind of like, like I imagine, like you know, if like if you were to rewatch like Attack on Titan, you mm-hmm. know, and having yeah. context, you can be like, oh fuck, it's that character, like Vast. oh shit, or like watch out for him. This, you yeah. know what I mean? It's Vastly like different. All of yeah. that, yeah. like you have little, the clarity now. Yeah, when you're going exactly. Back. Yeah, yeah, uh, absolutely, mm-hmm. absolutely. Um, but yeah, that that's really kind of what goes down there. Uh, Lower Row has mm-hmm. this conversation, pushes them back. I'm trying to just scroll through now to just make sure that we didn't miss anything going on. Um, you know, at, at least as in terms of the anime as a comparison, but yeah, you know, bam again, unfazed, um, you know what I mean? By the, uh, mm-hmm. by the initial push, um, he's kind of just like immune to the, you Bro, know what I mean? the face. I, do you remember his name? I was Shibisu. Shibisu. Oh, Shibisu. When they, in the manhwa, they have the perfect fucking face. I don't even think, I they think they have it in the him. anime too. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, did yeah, they, they have did. that yeah, in the anime? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, then I completely forgot it because when I was scrolling through and I saw that dude, I was dying. He's I was like, so yeah. funny, man. God. He's so funny. It's amazing. I actually love him. <laughs> he, I, they do pretty good justice to him, I would say, in the anime, oh, I would yeah. say. Yeah. But he's just one of my favorite characters well, that's, in general. That's he's the, so one good. of the things, right? It's nice to see that like a lot of his moments and his character, I would even say, like really like shot for shot was carried over from the yes. manhwa because he is like, you know, the manhwa, you read it and you're like, mm-hmm this dude's funny. Like, you know what I mean? And yeah. seeing that in the anime, it's like, that was like, they carried it over perfectly. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah, no, for sure. Um, So yeah, that's going to wrap up the first 10 chapters yeah. Yeah. of Sounds the manhwa. Uh, I mean, next, you know, next week we'll get into uh, chapters 11 uh, through 20. 20 yep. yeah. Um, And again, we're, you know, we'll go over things like the actual explanation of the tower and, reg- you know, like right, regulars right, yeah. and regulars, things like that. Yep. A little more in depth, Leroy's character and things that relate to the anime. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I enjoyed this. Yeah. What'd you guys think? This was pretty yeah. cool. This is nice. cool. Again, I guess like, let us know if you guys want us to do more in a week or let like, you know, yeah, like, exactly. how you guys would. L- I have a feeling look. it's going to pick up as we go along. Like right now, the first probably 20 to 30 chapters, they're going to be not as like intense because you know, right, they, right. they kind of are verbatim yeah. you know, with more yeah, dialogue. Yeah, yeah. And even in the anime, but, it was a lot of like exposition before you like hit any yeah. sort of, you know, but I have a feeling once we start getting like in the fifties or so, like shit's going to be like picking up quick and we're yeah, going to yeah. want to do it in like these like 10 increment chunks. Yeah. So. Yeah. So let us know yeah. your thoughts down below. Like I said before, if you have any sort of pointers, ideas, um, preferences, things like that, we're always open to suggestions yep, and sure, you know, sure. then we'll talk it amongst each other and see where it takes us from there. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed the first 10 chapters of the manhwa, at least our thoughts on it and how it relates to the anime. It's been a long time coming, but I'm excited to continue on this trend. Yeah, yes. um, you know, I week love, by I just, week. I love Tower of God, dude. Yeah, I love Tower this God's world. Great. I yep. love these characters. Mm-hmm. It's dope. Absolutely. Mm. So, yeah, make sure you guys are tagging along for the ride, all of you uh, TOG fans that were with us for the anime. Stick with us for the manhwa. If you haven't read it yet, I encourage you that you do because I could already sure. see that there's this is a great story mm-hmm. ahead of us past what we know already um but that's really it guys until next time thank you so much for listening we'll catch you all on the flip peace
Hey folks, thank you so much for listening. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss our new episodes. You can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at AOA Podcast if you want to keep up with our content or suggest new ideas for the show. You can watch us on YouTube or listen to us on iTunes, Spotify, Google Play, Podbean, or more. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you guys next week to talk about all things anime. Ninjas are samurai, blaze of the cool knives. Find me in the leaf of the cloud, screaming out Bankai. We just some ghouls.